Can omega-3 fish oil be used as a joint health supplement? Would it be smart to take this if you've got arthritis, bone-on-bone -bone joints, disc injuries, meniscus problems, or other joint health issues? In this video, I'll teach you about omega-3 fish oil as a health supplement to see if it's the right thing to be taking for your joint problems. So first off, what the heck is fish oil? How do we get fish oil? Now this is pulled from fish like herring, mackerel, sardine, and anchovy. And there's fat in fish and they pull the oil out of the fat and that's how they make fish oil. Now omega-3 specifically is an essential fat, which means it's not one that our body can make on its own. So we've got to get it from our food sources. And there's two types of omega-3s in this one specifically, it's EPA and DHA. You don't have to know the acronym and or the name of it. Those are short for these long names that I can't even pronounce. But those are two different types of omega-3 fatty acids that you need for your health. Now, omega-3 has been recommended by the American Heart Association and by many doctors over the years as a heart supplement, as something to take if you're at risk or if you've already had a heart attack or cardiovascular disease. But it's well known that it's an anti-inflammatory for our entire body, not just our heart and artery system. So it makes sense to use this as an anti-inflammatory joint supplement. There is research to show that this can reduce inflammation in your joints. So I would highly consider taking this if you've got any sort of joint issue. And what's the downside of taking omega-3s? Well, really only taking in extremely high doses has it been found to be harmful. Like if you've got diabetes, it could raise your blood sugar. It could thin your blood too in high doses which is why it says on the label here, if you're taking blood thinners, you should consult your doctor before taking omega-3. But the doses that they looked at for causing those problems are eight grams per day. One of these pills is 950 milligrams, which is just 50 milligrams shy of one gram. So you could take a few of these a day and still be under that threshold where you could get elevated blood sugar or other problems. Everybody's body reacts differently to different supplements and different foods. So you might get elevated blood sugar if you're at a risk for that. Like if you've got diabetes, type 1 or type 2 diabetes, then you should probably be very careful in taking the omega-3 fish oil and only take one pill at a time, one of these soft gels at a time, rather than taking two or three or more. If you are pregnant or nursing, you should consult with your doctor about taking this just because um, you know we don't know how it's gonna affect your baby or if you're, if you're nursing your milk and that will affect the baby. And if you have small children in the home that aren't really sure what they're putting in their mouths or not, you need to be careful with having these pills available too. Now these don't come in a child safety container. They come in, uh, in just like a standard twist top container. Um, so they're not child proof. And as you can see here, these soft gels are enormous. I mean, even for an adult, it's pretty big. So you don't want a child choking on this. I don't think fish oil's harmful for children. It's probably good for them to be taking it, in fact. But you don't want them to take it in this form. They do sell it in liquid form, like where you can spoon it out and have a tablespoon. Um, but these soft gels, not recommended for small children. Higher doses, this does potentially cause blood thinning problems. So if you're taking blood thinners already like warfarin or heparin, then you need to be careful and check with your doctor before you start taking omega-3 in addition to your medications that you're already checking. And that goes for any medications you're checking. Make sure you are visiting with your doctor and asking them, have a conversation and just say, hey, I heard that omega-3 might help my, my arthritis or my heart health as well. Is that okay if I'm taking it even though I'm on warfarin right now? Then follow your doctor's advice. Let me give you my honest opinion about omega-3 fish oil. I think it's fantastic for you to be taking. The downsides are really low relative to the upsides of this. I mean, getting your heart health, your artery health better, but if you have knee arthritis, hip arthritis, if you've got back problems, arthritis in your spine, degenerative disc disease, degenerative joint disease anywhere in your body, if you have herniated discs or meniscus problems, any sort of cartilage injuries, you want to make sure that the cells in your cartilage, the cells in your discs, all of those are at their optimal health. And so taking 
a supplement like this that can reduce inflammation and help the cell membranes is a no-brainer. You need to be taking something like this to put yourself in a position where you can maximize your joint health. Now, this alone is not going to fix an arthritis problem or a cartilage problem, but it's going to create the environment inside your body where all the building blocks, all the, the potential um, chemicals that, the, that make up your body are gonna be there so that when you do the right exercises and, and, and offload and load your joints properly, fix the muscle imbalances, then you're going to have the best healing situation afterwards how to use this supplement. Now, I would recommend taking up to three of these per day. So these specifically are 950 milligrams. It's triple strength, so they're, that's why they're a little big. Um, they're, they're more compact. Uh, but taking three of these a day, I think, gives you the right dosage in order to get the maximal anti-inflammatory benefits. So as long as you've checked with your doctor and you can take these, I'd start taking three a day. And um, I've linked this in the description below. You can get these off Amazon. I love this brand specifically, Solgar. Um, they do a good job of making all their products as hypoallergenic as possible, meaning there's like no dairy. It says on here, gluten-free, HMO-free, or non-GMO, wheat and dairy-free. And uh, these are soft gels as well. And, and they, they do an excellent job of, of making their products just high quality. I mean, these are real glass containers, not plastic. And it's that amber glass like beer bottles um, because it reduces the light coming through so that it doesn't uh, ruin the, the supplement. And that's especially important with oils because oils can, can get rancid. They, they spoil essentially uh, the more that they're exposed to the elements. So you need to keep these in a good container like, like the amber glass bottles that Solgar uses. Now this does need to build up in your bloodstream, in your system. So I would recommend taking these for 60 days. So if you're taking three a day, then one bottle will last you about a month because uh, there's 100 pills, 100 uh, gel capsules or soft gels in one container, so that, that'll last you about 30 days. So get two. They come in a two-pack if you get them off Amazon or if you find them at the store, look at getting two or replace one as soon as you run out of the other one so that you can put it in your body for, th for 60 days. Take three per day, once a day with a meal so that it doesn't ruin your stomach, it doesn't upset your stomach. That way you can properly digest it as well. One more thing I want to mention about this Solgar brand is you can see it says there on the label, let's see if the light isn't shining it off too much. It says purified to eliminate mercury. So they go the extra mile to make sure that they take out all the bad stuff and they're only giving you really, really good stuff. Hey, if you thought this video was helpful for you, give it a thumbs up, share it with a friend who you think needs help with their arthritis problems, their cartilage issues, back issues, so that they can get benefit as well. And please subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the helpful videos we post each and every week. Our channel is focused on making helpful videos with tips, advice, exercises, and stretches, as well as reviewing helpful products that can help you with your body aches. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.